The Mets coming to terms with veteran starting pitcher Julio Tehran is obviously not a particularly newsworthy or big deal thing, but on this rainy day, it's worth taking a moment uh, to explain the context of why they did it and how it came together. Mets have been a little thin in that rotation, of course, all along, especially since Kodai Senga and now Tyler McGill went down. After Senga's injury, they came very close early in spring training to signing Tehran then, uh, Tehran went to Baltimore on a non-roster invite for spring training uh, with an opt-out. The reason he signed with the Orioles at that time was that they offered a $100,000 signing bonus, which is unusually high uh, for a minor league spring training signing. So he went there. He didn't make the club. He opted out. McGill got hurt. And here he is with the Mets. It obviously makes all the sense in the world to bring in another arm. Mets are very thin in that rotation, both in terms of quantity of arms now and the quality of the starts that they've received, and now they will have another veteran to help layer over those prospects while they wait for those guys to come along.